Good morning, guys. I hope everyone had a great long weekend. Um, your parents may have shared with you that some things are going to change with our e-learning. Um, there's not going to be paper packets coming home. Instead, a lot of the teachers worked hard to put bags together of all your school supplies from the classroom. And so when you see your bag, you're going to see a lot of the things that we used every single day when you were with me. Um, you are going to have your literacy book, your math, social studies, and then your composition notebooks, your spiral notebooks, paper, pencils, crayons, erasers, and I even threw in some uh, pencil sharpeners for you guys. Um, the routine is going to stay very similar to how it was in the classroom. Every morning you are going to wake up to a greeting from me that has our journal prompt. Remember that you put your journal entry in your composition notebook. Some of yours is black and white, others are red, green, or they have characters on it. But remember, you date it, you write the prompt, and then you respond to it. You give me at least five sentences and then you can draw a picture to go with what you wrote about. Um, our prompt today is, how would you spend a day with no electricity? Um, be creative with it. What do you think you would do? Could you imagine being at home during this time with no electricity? That means no computers, no tablets, no light, no cell phones, no microwave, no oven. What would you do without electricity? How would you spend your time? As you write, I want you to remember I took our anchor chart from, home, or from school that you need to use your capital letter at the beginning of the sentence. Use finger spaces, best handwriting. You guys are in third grade. You know the deal. Make sure you have your punctuation. And then you're not going to see the word wall, but if you have trouble spelling a word, you can ask me or you can look it up. Use the resources that you have around you. Um, I will be sending several videos today to cover the different lessons that I need you to accomplish, and that's kind of going to be our routine for the remainder of the time until we go back to school. Do your best work. You guys know what I expect from you. Um, and if you need help, we can Zoom together. We can FaceTime. Remember, every Wednesday, we have our classroom Zoom chat, and that's a time that you can ask me questions. We can talk about things and just connect with each other. I want you guys to know how much I miss you, um, and I look forward to reading your responses and seeing you guys. Uh, take care.